scene opens on our intrepid hero, who's really more of a lazy bum. He awakens, yawns, stretches and scratches, tramps down the hall towards the bathroom, feeling fat and overweight and out of shape. The scale spins up to confirm his worst suspicions, and he thinks, aha, I know how to fix this. He laces up the running shoes and heads out for a run around the block and comes back feeling really hurt, dives into the Doritos, and pitches the running shoes. Yoga can't hurt, he thinks, and he heads off to the studio, and comes back really hurt, and dives into the junk food. And walking through town, his eye is caught by the rock hopper in the bike shop window. He plunks down the cash, walks out with a bike that looks suspiciously like a tricross. And heads off on that first ride in tennis shoes and baggy shorts. And he's hooked. He starts changing his life, he starts digging into the bananas, drinking water. Heads out on the trails again and again, finally gets all the good stuff. He's feeling good, he's feeling fit. And the scale reflects that. In his confidence, he meets a pretty girl out on the trails, and they head out together sharing quality time. They get married, and then his husband and wife, they head out on the trails. Life happens, and a baby's on the way. The baby comes, mom is happy, dad is happy, the bike is very unhappy. As the baby grows, the bike is further neglected, and then further neglected. Dad's struggling. It's dad thing is hard. He remembers the joy of the bike ride. He starts cleaning off that bike and he heads out on the trails that he loves again. Gratuitous logo shot! He comes back. He feels like a better dad. He knows that what needs to happen is each kid really needs a bike so they can go out together as a family. Hitting up the trails as the family grows and grows and grows.